Once upon a time, in a small, quiet village nestled between rolling hills and a crystal clear river, there lived a young woman named Eliza. Eliza was known throughout the village for her remarkable acts of kindness. Her smile was as warm as the sun, and her heart was as big as the vast blue sky. One sunny morning, as Eliza was walking to the village market, she noticed an elderly man sitting on a weathered bench by the road. He appeared tired and weary, his face etched with the wrinkles of time. Without hesitation, she approached him and greeted him with a cheerful, Good morning, sir. Is there anything I can do to help you today? The old man looked up at Eliza, surprised by her kindness. He explained that he had been trying to get to the market but found the journey more arduous than he'd anticipated. Eliza, without a second thought, offered her arm to the old man and guided him down the path towards the market. She talked to him along the way, sharing stories of the village and its history. As they reached the market, the old man was overwhelmed with gratitude. He had not expected such selflessness from a stranger. Eliza helped him find the items he needed and even insisted on carrying his heavy bag. News of Eliza's kindness spread like wildfire through the village. The people were inspired by her actions and began to look out for one another, just as she had done. It was as if a wave of kindness had washed over the entire village. Months passed and the village continued to flourish in this newfound spirit of compassion. The villagers organized food drives for those in need, volunteered to help the elderly with their chores, and supported each other through both joys and sorrows. It seemed that the simple act of kindness that Eliza had shown to the old man had ignited a transformation within the village. Eliza became a revered figure in the community, not for any material wealth or power, but for her boundless kindness and unwavering compassion. She had shown the village that one person's act of goodness could spark a chain reaction of benevolence. In the end, it was not the grand gestures or the extravagant gifts that defined the village, but the daily acts of kindness that happened between neighbors, friends, and even strangers. Eliza had shown them the way, and they had embraced it, creating a village that would forever be known for its extraordinary kindness. And so, in that small, but quiet village, the residents understood a simple truth, kindness must see, and when it does, it can change the world, one act of compassion at a time.